Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Happy Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to each and every person. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Oh my God, ladies and gentlemen, we are at the end of the year. I am so happy that the year 2019 is just so over. Oh my God, what a year, what a year, what a year. Okay. So what is happening, ladies and gentlemen, is that we are going to be checking out for you guys what is happening in December, okay? And this is wonderful because um, whatever is happening and transpiring, I'm seeing that the energies in December is going to be old and up, okay? And when I said old and up, I mean that... Um, uh this what is happening is that <laughs> a lot is going to be transpiring okay so be aware of that because um we are in a state where a lot of changing on this planet is going to be happening there is just so much changes that is coming up on this planet and we have to be aware of them okay so wonderful um energies are coming in okay um it is uh, it is a time when people are going to be starting to looking at themselves uh, uh, in different ways different forms and trying to understand what exactly is going on around them changes are coming up on this planet there is no question about it change is going to be coming up on this planet um, there is a lot of changes that is going to be coming up on this planet. So whatever the situation is and whatever is transpiring in your world, expect a lot of changes to be coming in. And this is going to be God. Um, life is about to change on this planet. So we're coming to the end of uh, a lot of, uh, um, you know, unexpected things that is going to be coming in your life and that sort of a thing where you need to find out who you are and you need to make the changes okay the energy of this month is the moon the energy of the moon okay um so what happened with the energy of the moon is there a secrecy as i have given in the third quartal reading go back and check out the third quartal reading i did said that a lot of uh, um a lot of uh, um you know earthquakes uh, flooding and that sort of a thing as you can see um the floodings have been happening around the world i did give that that a lot of flooding was going to be coming in a lot of floodings was going to be happening and it's because of uh, the energy of the secrecy and that sort of a thing secrets are coming out people are seeing things that was happening and transpiring so um that is where you're seeing a lot of uh, information is coming out information that was sealed off is now coming out and that sort of energy is going to be here so ladies and gentlemen the month of december happy birthdays to all the sagittarius and capricorns um this is your month i am loving it for you um, whatever the energies that is coming up for you there is the extended reading go check out the extended reading and see what is going on um, I want to say to each and everyone I am so appreciative and so grateful um, for all the support and help that has been happening and transpiring okay so um, please um, share my video share 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 this is the general um, reading for December and I'm asking each and every one of you remember someone else that has nothing to eat. Okay. Because, um, and Thanksgiving. So some of you might be getting this before Thanksgiving. Remember the people that are, um, unable to provide for themselves and, uh, give a helping hand at a soup kitchen or that sort of a thing. I love, um, I'd love to say to each and every one of you out there, whatever that is transpiring and happening, you got to know that the universe, uh, um, the universe is here and um, you're going to be helped. OK, you're going to be help. Um, if you do not have enough money to give a reading to to buy a reading. Mm. Got to always drink green things, ladies and gentlemen, it's good for you. 
Mm. For the people who don't have enough money to buy gifts, buy a reading for someone. A reading is timeless. All my readings are timeless. Buy a reading for someone, and that is going to be good. Oh, let's read. Universal angels and guides, I'm calling upon you, Mother, Father, God, all the legions of the angels, the angels of the month of December. Come in, show us what energy is coming up. I'm asking Archangel Michael to send in my horror, guide and protect me. Ladies and gentlemen, let's go into reading. December is four weeks, okay? So let's check out and see what's going to be coming up for these four weeks in December. So we have a judgment call. We have the energy. This is unexpected news. It's going to be coming in in the first week. And it's normal because it's the month of December. Unexpected news is going to be coming up in the first week. Whatever news that is coming in, this is emotional. So it can be good emotional or it can be bad emotion. It depends on who you are and how and whatever the situation that is playing out for you. Strength um, is the energy of the first week. It's a fire week, okay? Fire is when you go within to find the inner passion to keep you going. So not to worry. Then we have the second week, another fire week. This is good. The carousel, the carousel is that you're moving forward. You're going to be victorious and successful over an issue, a situation that has been playing out in your life. And this is really good because we have two fires. So the first week, it's kind of hard, but the second week, everything is going to be falling in place. So this is going to be very, very wonderful and very perfect perfect alignment for the energy that is coming in so we have two fire weeks so we're ending the year on the energies of fire in the third week we have the energy of the hermit something is going to be coming out something is going to be um um the light is going to be shed on something something that was happening something that was transpiring the light is going to be shed on this whatever and whoever that was keeping secrets and indecision things so this is really going to be coming out and it's going to affect people okay so um the light is going to be shed on something so third week is a little bit emotional it's the week of christmas so be aware of this third week is the week of christmas as we get to the end of the year and the last week we see a new beginning isn't this wonderful and if you go back and look at all my readings like the last week in december always the beginning coming up because it's a new start this is an air energy so everyone is about to make a new start a new shift whether or not it's your birthday or not your birthday this new start and this new shift is going to come in and this is what i want to explain to people so we have two fire water and a new start oh my god ladies and gentlemen this is going to be a beautiful end of the year okay there is something else i want to explain to a lot of people a lot of people who are not aware and do not understand what is going on i want to explain something to people the only people who start the year and can make resolution um for the first of january is only the people who were born in the month of january if you were born in february first of february going on you can go with the chinese new year but um for westerners and the people who um do resolution do not make any resolution if you weren't born in the month of january because it's not going to work you need to make resolution a week before your birthday okay because that's when your zodiac year start because a lot of people are not aware of that and this is why resolution doesn't really work out it's because you are making resolution where it's not your birthday okay it's just a new year it is the general energy for the planet for the hurt but it's not your birthday so whatever is happening and whatever is transpiring it's not really your birthday so you can't make a resolution because that's why people resolution does not come true okay always call and ask for a birthday reading or go online all my readings are going to be 15 percent for every three reading that you download you are great but you have to um, put three readings in a box before you receive your 15%. Three readings in a box before you receive your 15%. Okay, so 
Um, if you want to order a year reading, the year 2020, please um, start ordering them from now so you can get them off in time for Christmas because I love when um, the day of Christmas that you're sitting down before you go to eat, you can check out your own reading to know what is coming up in 2020. So I always get out year readings that I get before um, the month of December. I always get them out so that people get them right on time for Christmas that it drops in their mailbox. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm here to stay. So no matter what is going on, we're here. We're going to be keeping this up. Um, I'm going in my fifth year of doing this. This is what I was meant to be doing. And I, I choose to help humanity in this form and this way. Okay. So ladies and gentlemen, the first week is going to be the week of strength, which is always the same in December because you're rushing around to get gifts and that sort of a thing. And we have the energy of the carousel. Whatever is happening to people, I'm seeing the energy of a new beginning is going to be coming in. Let's see the first week to the second week of December in for the general reading. Um, um, calling up and this fear, see me angels. What is going to be happening for you guys? Okay, so we see justice, justice, justice. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. So whatever is transpiring, some of you have to find strength in the, the first week, but the second week you're coming out on top. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, so um, first week, second week, um, balance is going to be coming in. A lot of you, if you had issues, you're going to be celebrating overcoming issues in your life. The first week is a little bit hard, but the second week, the result is going to be coming out. Third week, going in the fourth week where um, you have overcome a situation and the truth is coming out. And then you have the energy of the sun. Bow, wow, wow. So, ladies and gentlemen, if you are waiting for um, if you're waiting for a result from an uh, a legal issue or that sort of a thing, you are going to be successful. Okay, now all of you, we we're going to check out to see who. Now the oracle is here, and whatever secrets there was is going to be coming out. The orc is here and whatever secrets there was in the third week, going in the fourth week, the energy of the oracle, the oracle always comes up in the Christmas week. However, way you look at it, the oracle, she's always coming up in Christmas week because these are your spirit guides and your angel guiding you, giving you information to move forward. The oracle is bringing a new start out for some of you. And for some of you, the oracle is here I'm showing the truth to a situation. So your spirit guides and guiding angel, whatever you are wishing for and dreaming for, the sun and the oracle, your wishes and dreams for some of you are going to be coming out. And especially the people who were born in the week of uh, um, uh, Christmas, I'm seeing that you're going to be very, very surprised. There's some surprise energy that is coming in. I'm seeing your spirit guide is going to be orchestrating something because you guys have been going through a very, very rough time. Okay. All right. Let's move forward and see what is coming out in the second week. You're going to be victorious and successful over um, lies, deception, secrets, whatever lies and deception and secrets is the second week you're going to be um, you know, overcoming these issues and the situation, things that you were not aware of, whoever that was dealing with some injustice and imbalanced things, you're going to be overcoming this issue in the second week because you have the energy of the carousel. The carousel is the energy of the wheel is turning in your favor and that is going to be good and it's going to be very positive. What I'm also seeing is that whatever secret that was kept from you in the third week, information is going to be coming out because the energy of this month is the energy of the sun, the sun and the moon. The sun and the moon is the energy of this month. And whenever the sun and the moon comes up is whenever secrets, lies, deceptions, deception, um, things that had gone um, without you knowing about them, it's going to be coming out. But there is going to be a balance because uh, um, whatever the injustice is or was, uh, there is definitely going to be a balance. So, the energy, um, again, the energy of the train, the energy of the train is here. 
where a um, wonderful positive forward movement a new start is going to be coming up some of you could be traveling in the third week some of you are definitely a lot of traveling is happening here in the third week whatever the issue the situation is a lot of traveling is going on in the third week the third week is coming up with a lot of traveling whatever the issue is and the situation is in the third week a lot of traveling is coming up and this is going to be fantastic because um, the wheel of fortune is here with the sun and a victorious successful so the wheel is turning in your favor I'm seeing some of you coming in the month of December standing strong and the wheel is turning in your favor the outcomes of the month is commitment so I'm seeing some of you um, if you apply for a job it's a yes um, a new contract is coming out I'm seeing um, people whatever issues and situation legal issues so a lot of marriages is going to be happening in December but this is really going to be positive because I'm seeing you guys coming out of December with this really positive alignment from energy where you're making a commitment with you and another person and this is going to be good a commitment between you and another person and this is going to be good so the energy of the lovers come out in um, the um, as the outcomes for the month of December obviously because it is Christmas and I'm seeing the spirit guides and the universal angels are really working behind the scenes to balance out whatever situation that is going on in your life and other people's life I'm seeing whatever that was happening between you and a partners I'm seeing a lot of marriage coming up there is just as so much a lot of marriage is coming up and this is going to be good so whatever the situation is in your life uh, I am seeing that most of you are ending the month of December coming out of uh, um, deceptive situation okay there was deceptive situation you're coming out of these deceptive situation this is going to be good because some of you who were standing in an hangman who were waiting who were just waiting for things situation to resolve these are going to definitely resolve and it's going to be good so the outcomes is very beautiful with the energy of commitment the outcomes is very beautiful with the energy of commitment and what this is actually doing is that uh, um, the universe is connecting people situations together and it's ending the month with a new start so I'm seeing you move in together a lot of people are going to be deciding to move in together or planning to be together this is going to be wonderful because I'm seeing that universal angels and guides are going to be doing that for the Leos it's going to be the Leos if you have legal issues not looking that good okay for the Leos if you're having some legal issues it's not going to be looking that good um, and um, you got to be aware um, the wheel of fortune is coming in I'm seeing a balance a balance is coming in um, um, new beginnings is going to be happening for a lot of people I'm seeing your spirit guides whoever wants a new beginning I'm seeing your spirit guides making this new beginning I'm seeing new contracts so if you were applying for new jobs it's definitely your ending the month off and this year um, with something and beginning something for yourself so I'm seeing a lot of uh, um, the, the, the the most positive thing is that the carousel and the Sun the carousel and the Sun it is the wheel of fortune and the Sun the second week is the energy of the carousel and the middle and center of the month is the Sun so it is going to be a very positive energy a very positive situation that is going to be transpiring for you guys it's going to be wonderful because the universe is about to, to make some changes on this planet and it's going to be affecting a lot of people so I'm seeing that some of you if you were having legal issues with a cancer I'm seeing you're going to be victoriously coming out of this legal issue with a cancer whoever the cancer is whatever that has to inspire you I'm seeing you're going to be having a, a new start moving forward for some of you who have legal issues I'm seeing this legal issues over a cancer you're going to be successful moving away from whatever this issue and the situation is 
um the the hermit the energy of the hermit is coming in and the energy of the hermit is always that um um it's affecting it's really affecting the pisces and the scorpion the pisces and the scorpion and whatever is transpiring i'm seeing the truth is coming out about um or and and um you know ask for a reading ladies and gentlemen and why i'm advising you guys 2020 is going to be a lot of changes for a lot of people and depends on your um your zodiac sign that's how it's going to be affecting you guys depends on your zodiac sign that's how it's going to affecting you guys okay so be aware of that whatever what 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 is happening here and transpiring is that life is about to change for a lot of us on this planet and whether or not we're where we are ready for this it's it's coming up and december is kind of ending a situation december is definitely ending a situation whatever that was happening and transpiring december is definitely ending the situation because what i'm seeing here is that whatever that was happening um underneath the scenes there could be some um um winter storms as we move towards the end of the month of december there could be some winter storms so people in coal area because um we are in um we're closer to the sea um in holland but um the winter is going to be very cold in russia i'm seeing a russia switzerland um italy is also getting some of this whiplash um, um um switzerland italy um austria um russia is definitely going to be having some really um cold um winter uh, storms coming in so i'm seeing all of this so depends on where you are i'm seeing canada is going to be getting uh, having a very cold winter as usual but colder than normal so you guys gotta be north the north um um whew, uh, whew, um new york is gonna be hit with some real cold days and um jersey um connecticut uh massachusetts chicago is uh, the cold is going to be killing um in this year so ladies and gentlemen um be aware because um of the horizon layer and um, what is transpiring is there um very very much so changes in our weather pattern so this is definitely going to be happening there is no question but for the rest i'm saying that christmas is going to be spent it's as if you know if you haven't seen your family in a very long time please go home go home and visit your family ladies and gentlemen please connect with your family at christmas because whatever is the energy in this year is going to change people and situation as we move into 2020 we're moving out of the energy of the aquarians in the uh, energy of the of from out pisces in the aquarians and this is really really something that is happening and as we go to 2020 ladies and gentlemen this planet everything on this planet is about to change so be aware of this it's going to be powerful it's going to be powerful there is no question we're not asking what is going to be happening because we know um it's going to be a very powerful christmas but it's going to be good because what is happening and what is transpiring is that life is about to change for each and every person on this planet and we just got to be aware of that okay please share these videos let people know what is going on please go if even you haven't spoken to your family in a long time go okay transition into wish and patient so this this month is going to be transition intuition and patient whatever is transpiring whatever is happening for you out there ladies and gentlemen it's going to be a month of transition intuition and patient patient is going to be called for um the energy of the angels are here one and three is four the phoenix is showing up the phoenix can be used to make changes and transition in your life ladies and gentlemen life is about to change on this planet and please realize the changes that is coming up we can't um, um move these changes okay so we have the energy of the swan queen whenever the swan queen comes up it's um 
it guides it, it, it makes a way and it opens the way and guides you you can ask the swan queen um to look at your reflection in the events of your life okay and she will give you the ability to see the beauty that has transformed your life uh, from ignorance to wisdom again ladies and gentlemen the swan queen will let you see how to transform your life from ignorancy to wisdom wow that is beautiful um the swan queen can also let you know that it's time to go within and seek the answers in your own intuition and this is what i'm trying to teach people and let people understand instead of you asking other people question go within ask the, your own inner guidance which is your intuition is this the correct don't look outside of yourself for answers the truth and the power lies within you okay i've always tried to tell people that i can give you information but also go research information for yourself okay as you look within use water drink a lot of tea um and and drink a lot of water and this helps your intuition now is the moment to meditate and ask for a vision okay so in the christmas time is a moment to meditate and ask for a vision okay the power of the psychic um, precision is inherited in you and the swan queen will help you to drive deeper in yourself to find the answer that you seek this is also a reminder to allow time to transform ideas into reality nothing happens before it's time ladies and gentlemen I want to say to you I love you all whatever you do enjoy your Christmas if even you're alone go find friends people to connect with go on the internet connect with a group listen to something but go within and change ignorancy to wisdom I love you guys I'm wishing you a wonderful wonderful um, Christmas I will speak to you before the New Year's love and light Namaste.